Hey, what's up? About one month ago, I ordered Realme 8i smartphone on AliExpress. However, I didn't pay attention to the fact that it is a Russian version, so the inscription on the box are in Russian, as well as that there are many Russian print styled apps, such as Yandex. Now I wonder how Russian version is different from the global one. And this is the first video with unboxing of Realme 8i. The next videos will be about performance, camera, battery, pros, cons of this smartphone. If you are interested, subscribe to our channel Tech Brothers not to miss new videos. The new Realme 8i smartphone comes in a yellow box. As I already said, there is a sticker with information about mobile device and manufacturer in Russian on the back of the box. Inside the box, there is a smartphone, power adapter, USB Type-C charging cable, silicon protective case and user manual. Ok, now let's take a look at the design of the new Realme smartphone. First, I want to talk with you about the color of Realme 8i. I have ordered a black color option of smartphone, but I am not sure if it is a really black. To me, it looks more like a burgundy. Do you agree that it is not a black color? Write in the comments below. This smartphone is also available in a purple color. On the rear panel of Realme 8i, we can see triple camera and flashlight, as well as Realme logo. The fingerprint reader is located on the side face. The volume rocker and slot for SIM and memory card are on the left side. The Realme 8i also has 3.5mm audio jack, microphone, USB Type-C port and speaker at the bottom. You know the new smartphone has a rounded shape, so it is very comfortable to hold in one hand. However, the rear panel leaves fingerprints. You need to wipe it down all the time to keep it looking nice. From other side, if you use a protective case, it is not a problem for you. The dimensions of Realme 8i are 164 by 75 by 8.5 mm. The weight is 195 grams. So this is not a very compact smartphone. You can see the comparison of Realme 8i and iPhone 12. And this is because Realme smartphone has a big 6.6 inch display. Talking about display, it has Full HD Plus resolution and 120Hz refresh rate. In the settings menu, we can choose light and dark theme. Change the screen brightness and turn on off the other options, such as auto brightness, eye comfort, auto rotate, auto screen off, etc. There is also a screen color mode, vivid and gentle. Realme 8i uses Ultra Vision Engine. You can activate Video Color Enhancer. If you want to change the screen refresh rate, then click on More, and then you will see this menu. As you can see, you can choose Auto Select, Standard, and High Refresh Rate. The display of Realme 8i is very good. It is one of the main features of this smartphone. The new Realme smartphone also has a good chipset, Helio G96. It doesn't support 5G networks, but the result in N2 is very good, 300,000 points. I have a model with 4GB of RAM and 128GB of storage. The smartphone is also available in version with 64GB of internal memory. You know, there's microSD memory card support, so you can buy 64GB version and use memory card. The next week, we will post a video with detailed performance test of Realme 8i. We will run benchmarks and play games on the new smartphone. I also want to tell you about software of Realme 8i. As already said, I have a Russian version of this smartphone. It seems that it doesn't differ from the global version, but there are many pre-installed Russian apps, such as Yandex, VK, OK, MirrorPay and others. Do you know these apps? Moreover, there is already installed TikTok on smartphone. By the way, we have account on TikTok. You can follow us as a link in the description under this video. Realme 8i runs on Android 11 with Realme UI 2.0. You know, this is my first Realme smartphone, so there are many interesting functions for me. I will tell you more about the user interface in the next videos about this smartphone. The rear camera of Realme 8i has 50 megapixels main sensor, 2 megapixels portrait sensor, and 2 megapixels macro lens. The front camera is 16 megapixels. I haven't tested the camera yet, but I see that there are many useful functions in the camera app, such as night mode, beauty, dual view video, ultra macro, etc. The video with camera test of Realme 8i will be posted later on our channel Tech Brothers. The battery of the new smartphone has a capacity of 5000 mAh. There is also 18W fast charging support. I can't say anything about battery, because I only use the smartphone for a few hours. We will do a battery test of Realme 8i and post a video in coming days. He knows the new Realme smartphone has only single speaker at the bottom, but the sound quality is pretty good. The speaker is also very loud.
Dr. Spider-Man. As already said, Realme 8i has dual SIM with Fuji LTE support. By the way, this is a Russian version of smartphone, but there is a global Fuji LTE band support. There is also NFC, so you can use a mobile device for contactless payments. You know, I have bought Realme 8i for $179 on AliExpress, but it looks very good at first glance. I like the design of this phone, as well as big and smooth display. However, I have a Russian version of smartphone, and there are many useless pre-installed apps. We will test the new Realme phone next days, and we will be posting new videos about it. Subscribe to our channel Tech Brothers, not to miss them. Thank you for watching, see you soon.